we did an online poll because we're very, very up with it. <laughs> um, and we said, has Brexit caused a fallout between you and your loved ones? A fifth of people said yes. So 20% said yes, 80% said no. OK. I'll tell you a bit of a funny story. You know, there was them signs everywhere, vote Rima in. So I said to my son one day, who's this politician Rima, then? <laughs> <laughs> Only you, Lynn. <laughs> and that, that is the level of debate. That is the informed level of debate <laughs> in Linda's household. But what... I think it is a good thing that the whole Brexit issue made people discuss politics and made uh, mm, made yeah, them yeah. discuss their yeah, values. We owned it, didn't we? But I think that one of the reasons why one in five people ended up, you know, went to relate, said it was because of Brexit, is because for the first time they knew a little bit more about what their partner thought yeah, yeah. Yeah. than they did before. Because, you know, during a courtship, and, you know, the exciting part of sex, and then that's worn off and you're living <laughs> together and blah, blah, blah. You're not exactly revisiting politics, yeah, are you? Yeah, you're not, absolutely. And I think that, that, as you said, Colleen, it was on the television every day. It was something we couldn't get away from, so suddenly we had to discuss yeah, stuff everyone. with our partners that we might not have done yeah. before.